soggy weather oh, out there. Dealt with it with an umbrella. And windy. Mm -hmm. Those winds are going to be kicking up later tonight. And Audrey Puente is joining here, joining us now. And I mean, it's just a sloppy mess out there for everybody for the morning commute. Yes, you're very. That's very true. We have a lot of moderate to heavy rainfall coming in across the tri-state area. So as you wake up, you want to grab that wet weather gear because you will be needing it all day long today. Here's a look at the radar, and we can see it's very impressive with the lighting up of the colors here. We can see we have heavy rainfall coming out of Long Island, crossing the Sound, and heading over towards parts of Connecticut at the moment. So it'll be a rough ride on 95, the Merritt Parkway as well, heading over towards Westchester. It's soaking over towards Harrison and White Plains and Yonkers as well, even into the Bronx. Across northern New Jersey, we have some wet roadways around I-80 into the northern part of the state where we did have uh, a deluge of heavy rain, but now it's more moderate rainfall that we're finding across the northern sections here. Same case as we go further south into central and southern New Jersey where we had heavy, heavy rainfall a little while ago from uh, Trenton over towards Belmar, right all across I-95, but or 195 rather, and it looks like we'd still have pockets of heavy rainfall. Nation that the nor'easter could bring widespread flooding to the area. Fox Eyes Kayla Mamlack live in Milburn, New Jersey with more. And Kayla, I have to ask, what has it been like traveling from New York City here, where our station is located, all the way out to New Jersey? What are the roads like? Well, Reagan, we really just took it slow and steady because the truth is road conditions this morning are less than ideal. It is really not safe to drive as usual if you are behind the wheel this morning. If you have to be behind the wheel this morning, you can tell just by looking here at Milburn Avenue here in Milburn and hope for the best. For now, we're live here in Milburn, New Jersey. Bianca, Reagan, send it back inside to you. All right, Kayla, thank you for that uh, showing us around town there. Yeah, and definitely, you know, to reduce the leaves on the grates, if you're watching right now, make sure because you need that water to flow to get out mm -hmm. of your stream, yeah. the river, the any anything, the, the driveway, what have you. So. Yeah, we've seen some people out there trying to do it after it's completely flooded. In Crack that. down some entertainment news. We're talking about Dave Chappelle. Yeah. yeah, Ryan Christopher joining us. What's going on now? Well, good morning there, ladies. Let's get you a little update. Mm -hmm. Interesting, though. But what can you ridicule them for? I mean... They're, 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 they're earlier days. The no, camp rock. That's you can't make fun. Well, yeah. you can't. I mean, the hair. It was beautiful. Yeah, hair I think back they then. do cool stuff now. Okay, but you didn't like the voluminous hair back then. Mm, camp rock. Okay, okay haters gonna hate. Me. I guess. Whatever. Not a fan. <laughs> all right. Well, that's all for Good Day Wake Up. Good day, New York. Think like, oh, I'm in my car. I'm gonna make it. But no. you know. You see people standing on top of their cars it's trying true. to get saved. The cars can quickly get can be lifted and floated away. You don't realize it. And you don't know how deep the water is. We always tell people, turn around, don't drown. Right? Right. And we mean that with cars right. as well. You don't want to go into water that you don't know the dip, depth of. And you're going to see a lot of that today. And listen, I don't want any excuses for Katie Couric tomorrow because tomorrow... Ooh.